I'm Megan. And I'm Ashley. And this, and this is, is Poor, Poor Decisions. Decisions. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Pino Grigio. <laughs> so the wine we picked out today, I think we were mostly sold on the name. Yes, the name was a big factor. This is called Sweet Bitch. Reminds me of Ashley. <laughs> <laughs> um, and it's a Pinot Grigio. And we literally just looked up how to pronounce that. I think we were mostly like Sweet Bitch had a lot of different kinds of wines. It did. There was like a Moscato and there was there wasn't a Riesling. I think there was a Chardonnay. There was a Chardonnay. And we've never had a Pinot Grigio before. Nope. So now we have one. Pinot Grigio is described as a zesty white wine, which is as refreshing as a cold glass of lemonade on a hot summer's day, according to this website. Fantastic. <laughs> it's actually the second most popular white wine in America. So hopefully that means we'll like it as long as so. Sweet Bitch knows what she's doing. Sweet Bitch better. <laughs> So this was a little on the cheap side. It was about $9.99. A fair price. It was a pretty fair price. Um, I'm just hoping it won't taste cheap. And the alcohol content we were pleased with, it is 12%. A whopping 12%. A whopping 12%, I'm ready. And as for the packaging, I just wanted to talk about this a little bit. First of all, sweet bitch is just priceless to me got like a little um, face, reminds me of Adele. And then what I really like is the back because it's a puppy dog. A doggo? The real sweet bitch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that reminds me of Pumpkin, she's a sweet bitch. Um. <laughs> All right, so you ready to taste this? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> It's it's a little sour, but like in a yeah the, in a grapey way. <laughs> the aftertaste is like a sour grape. It tastes like green grapes. It I, does. I, yeah. I sh we shouldn't be surprised. It's white wine. Yeah, very but... true. <laughs> um, yeah, the taste on my tongue though, it, it is leaving a very sour like yeah it's aftertaste. Like... Um, I'm not the most pleased with the aftertaste. No, I've had I like better it. aftertaste, but the wine itself is like. The wine itself is drinkable. Like I could chug this if I was having a bad day. And oh, I could. That's I what could I look for this. in alcohol. I could chug this. That's what this. I look for. So. Yeah, I personally enjoy the aftertaste. I bet it's gonna make the cheese taste better. Oh. <laughs> Maybe it won't. I don't even know if this cheese goes good with. We it. have some spicy cheese right now, so it's got some jalapeno in it. Yeah. It what like I like about aftertastes is when you have it with your cheese. It adds taste to the cheese that wasn't there before. Mm -hmm. uh, I like the aftertaste. It reminds me of grapes. Grapes. Which I hear wines are made with. Fun fact, if you didn't know. <laughs> All right. Today we also got the Garnier Skin Active Moisture Balm Sheet Mask. And it's supposed to be super hydrating and anti-fatigue, if you can see that. And I don't know about you guys, but as uh, two working adult women, we are always fucking tired. Um, I personally have really dark under eye circles all the time. I do too. And I, I'm ready to see if that's going to work on it. And um, I spent all fucking day studying CPR, um, which was supposed to be a two hour ordeal, but turned into a six hour one. So, um, so yeah, I'm going <laughs> to see, I'm going to see if that erases that uh, experience off of my face and hopefully it does. I hope it does too. Yes. All right, so our face masks today are made with lavender essential oil, which everybody should love. And it's also made with hyaluronic acid, which I just learned how to pronounce. I love hyaluronic acid. Obviously, acid. <laughs> I want that on my face. Yeah, I want some acid on our faces. We'll see <laughs> what it does. Let's talk about packaging. I, I think it's nice. Um, I like the color. Nice gradient in the background. Lavender? I, this is lavender, right? I, I think so. That shows us what it is. Smelling. Okay. What do you think it smells like? Do you smell the 
Do you smell the um? What's this it smelled like a wax I used to use. Lavender essential oil. I don't smell much lavender. No, this smells exactly like I used to use like Sally uh, Henson Hanson, if that's Hansen. how you say it, wax, and on it your... smells just like that. Wait, what'd you use it on? Oh, it's slimy. Oh. Let's do a taste test. It tastes horrible. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh my god. I the song for 15 minutes, so we'll have to keep track of that. Dude, I already, I think I already messed up. Oh, oh my god, how do you do this? Oh, it's cold. <laughs> it's freezing. Oh, oh, it's freezing. I can't do this. It's I already messed cold. up. My eye thing is like... It's so cold. <laughs> it's freezing. Wait, the blue goes on the outside, right? Yeah, but I think you're supposed to take the blue off once the paper's on, but I can't figure out how <laughs> to... Oh, I got it. I got it. Dude, I, I have to take the blue off. I don't know off. why it, you need to take the blue off though. I'm taking the blue off now because uh, it was in the way of my eye holes. And I'm fond of my eye holes. Dude! Oh, Jesus Christ. Just um, a Ugh. disclaimer, I'm sure you can tell we're both wearing makeup, but we purposely Ugh. didn't wear foundation so that the face Ugh. mask would still work. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Oh my god! <laughs> when I laughed, it sucked right into my nose. <laughs> I couldn't breathe! <laughs> Girl, what is in my mouth? Is that the mustache? That was above your. That's the mustache. <laughs> I can't breathe with this on. Oh. Okay, let me move this. Oh, wait, I'll move this out of your way. Oh. <laughs> Keeps getting in my mouth. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm feeling it. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting waterboarded. <laughs> this is a torturous experience. As a joke, we, we were doing taste earlier, oh, no. but <laughs> I can definitely say that the taste of this is really fucking bad, guys, because I tasted it. I think it's getting in my wine. <laughs> I just genuinely can't breathe in this, so. <laughs> it's so, it's so wet. Oh my god, shit. Ugh. It's very wet. <sighs> It's wetter than this pussy. It's wetter than this sweet bitch. <laughs> um, I'd like to document that I'm getting like a burning sensation almost. Uh -oh. Like like here. If you need to take it off, you should take it off. It's not, it's it's like a mild burning. Like Because if you find you're allergic to it, this isn't a great way to find oh, out. Oh, I hope I'm not allergic to this. Oh lord. I feel it too though. I feel a little bit of a burn. Yeah. Not like a bad one, not like an I'm allergic to this burn, more like, um... Just, it's not a bad burn. It's a mild burn. It's like, I would suffer for my beauty. <laughs> <laughs> the mouth hole is definitely not big enough for wine drinking, so I think that's a definite no for me. I think there shouldn't be a mustache, like, part of this. I don't think it's necessary. <laughs> You're my name Santa Claus. <laughs> and also, since the mouth hole is so small, which by the way. Are you ripping it off? <laughs> I'm ripping the mouth hole so it's big enough. Oh my god, I want to breathe, so. Okay, that's much better. <laughs> you ripped it off! <laughs> <laughs> A bitch can't breathe! <laughs> I've got this in my lungs. that's something we've been dealing with for a while now. You just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. It's yeah. hard. <laughs> it's hard. It's hard. <laughs> Which is why we need these girls' nights. Um, I pretty much... <laughs> I really ripped this up. Um, I just graduated um, in December, and 
I'm pretty much in the process of finding a job in my field, but in the meantime, I work at Michael's, which I've been doing. <laughs> you can't stop we laughing. Just look so funny. We look really Sorry. weird. Um, so I've been working at Michael's while being in school for this past semester, and I've also had other jobs before Michael's that I did during school, and it's not fun. It's how you make money, though, while being a student. Yeah. <laughs> I just like your face. <laughs> And, um, and Ashley, you've just started some schooling. Yeah, um, so I decided that um, when I first started college, um, I really didn't know what I wanted to do. I just was going out of obligation. And um, that's not a good thing. I wouldn't recommend doing that. That's horrible, yeah. Yeah, so I ended up, um, like, before I completed my first year of college, I ended up dropping out. Um, because I was doing really badly in my classes because I was also trying to work for the first time ever in my life. Oh yeah, that'll kill you. Yeah, and do classes at the same time, so you know how terrible that it's is. It's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Let's not jump around that time. Yeah. It's terrible. And it like, uh, it affected my mental health, so I got really bad, uh, depression, so, and insomnia, which is not fun. Oh my god, I had that for a while. Yeah, so, <laughs> yeah. oh yeah, insomnia is not a good, a no. good thing to have. Sleep is, sleep is amazing. I think we can all agree. Or... I finally do it and it's the great. Yeah. It's, it's the greatest thing. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, and um, I'm, I've just been working um, for the past three years basically. Um, no, four years. Four years yeah. now, yeah. Four years, because it's 2018. Um, yeah, and you know, I've worked for, for, I'm on my fourth job right now. Not that I got fired or anything, I just was jumping around. And I'm, I have an adult job right now, so it's very, uh, it's kind of overwhelming, um, but it's it's nice and I have to go back to school for it. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's why you know, I was learning CPR earlier because it's required of me and it's it's going okay. It's, uh, it's just really stressful working and doing schooling at the same time is just, uh, it's a terrible experience, I think. Yeah, it is. Very overwhelming. Yeah, I know for a while, my schedule was Monday through Thursday classes, and Friday through Sunday was work, pretty much all day working, also all day doing homework anytime I wasn't working. So I really just had no time for myself last semester, and the only reason I think I survived it without getting really depressed or having a mental breakdown is because I knew I was graduating. Mm -hmm. So it was kind of doable, but I just didn't have any time for myself. I barely saw you, mm -hmm. barely saw any of my other friends. I saw Omar plenty because he's my boyfriend, but he's also in a lot of, he was in a lot of my classes, which is good for a relationship mm -hmm. when you have a life like that. Yeah. And you met him in college too, I right? I met him in college. Yeah. That's, you know, I, I have the mentality that if you didn't have to go to college to get a good job, that would be nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I wish that was the case, especially because, to be honest, like I'm an artist. I could learn all this through YouTube videos. Um, sorry, my mustache keeps... That's why I ripped mine off. I kept going in my mouth. <laughs> I'm ripping mine off. <laughs> Fuck the mustache yeah. area. Anyway. <laughs> So I just feel like I'm not a big fan of school, but I met Omar there, and he's great. So I he's think great. I think life threw me a bone there. It was like you're suffering. Have a nice boyfriend. Mm -hmm. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah, but I'm. Yeah, she did graduate, and I'm super proud of her. Oh, thank you. Super proud, and anyone who's graduating, who's uh, working in school towards graduation, who's doing schooling for a job, you should all be very proud of yourselves you because it's be. a very hard thing. It's a lot of work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, once you leave high school, life just hits you in the face, and she's not a sweet bitch. Life is not a sweet bitch. <laughs> I used to be such a sweet bitch. Now I'm a hard and Same. cold bitch. <laughs> Same. I used to be innocent, and then as soon as I graduated, Oh dear God. That's <laughs> why it's so I nice became... when you see the freshmen come in the next year, it's like, oh, look at them. They don't even know yet. 
I know. <laughs> They're still fresh. So fresh. I feel like I can't drink this with this on. I've, it, I think it's been like getting around the rim and I'm tasting it. <laughs> and it doesn't taste good. I keep like, my issue is I keep inhaling this mask like some way or another. It's getting like up my nose, in my mouth, in my lungs. Yeah. And um, I, I honestly, like I don't know how you feel yet, but this isn't the best experience for me. I preferably like the non-paper. So we just took our face masks off. We did, and we we had a dab. Um, we had a quick dab. We had a dab. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she did it. <laughs> I almost feel like it dried my skin out a little bit. Is that weird? That's not weird. I feel like my cheeks are better, but my forehead feels worse. And I don't know if that makes sense or not. No, like I, I feel that like my forehead my forehead in the mirror after I took it off, like and like walk, like you know, use the towel to dab my face, looked really oily, and um, I don't know what it looks like now, but does it look oily still? Shiny, but it's I shiny. wouldn't say oily. Like it, I don't know. I don't, I don't like it, guys. I don't like it, and I'm sorry, but I can't, I can't tell you that I enjoyed it. I just yeah. I'd say it's not really worth it, um, but it is cheap and maybe it'll work for you. I'd say if you have dry skin like me, it'll help you a little bit more than if you have combination skin like Ashley, because she put it on her whole face and if it's a combination, some places won't make any <laughs> some sense. Some places don't want it. <laughs> yeah. Don't need that extra you oil, You can cut it up and only put it where you need it. Oh yeah, definitely, <laughs> definitely cut that mask up because no one needs that. Uh... No that one needs mustache. that mustache area. No one needs that. Um, I would recommend a larger nose hole because I was unable to breathe at times. Yeah, the mouth hole in general was just way too small. I couldn't <laughs> properly drink my wine with it on. And that's an issue. It's an issue. I need this stuff. Amen. Speaking of the wine, mm -hmm. I like it. I think it's a really good white wine. It was cheap and it doesn't taste cheap to me. Do you agree with that? Mm-hmm. And um, I'm not. I'm feeling a buzz. This is my second glass, so I'm not going crazy yet. But 12% volume. If we keep drinking this, which I think we will, we will. We'll be drunk soon. Um, I just did my chug test, which is when I quickly <laughs> consume a glass of something. You just did your ju I chug did. test. And uh, <laughs> I didn't know you were doing this. Wine. It was cheap, and it doesn't taste cheap to me. Do you agree with that? What's your rating for the face mask out of 10? So, if I had a variety of like masks that I've tried in the past, the rating might be a little different, but I'm gonna rate it like a three. Like, it wasn't the worst thing in the world, but I, I don't know, I don't think I like paper masks now that I've tried one and it wasn't, I don't feel, like my skin even now feels like it's not burnt. It's like almost like a dull burn though, honestly. Like here and like up here. Like, hmm. Kind of like a dull burn. It didn't do anything for me, I think. Um, I don't think it helped me. I would also give it a three. Like I can see how... I think it's going in the right direction. It tried. It tried. But I'm gonna give it a three. And also the whole appearing less tired thing. Oh shit, I forgot it did that. I forgot that. about that. You look the same. You look the same. <laughs> it didn't do anything. No, I think we're. I think we can debunk that now. <laughs> Were you fatigued before you tried the mask? Well, you're gonna look fatigued after too. Maybe even a little bit more. Maybe more. It was a struggle. It was. It was a struggle. <laughs> um. How did you feel about the wine? The wine. Mmm. Ten being the best wine I've had. I've had good wines. Um. I'm gonna give this like. I'd give it seven and a half because eight is probably a little too good for it but she's such a sweet bitch she's she a sweet is. bitch she is yeah um i agree like i i give her a seven a solid seven solid seven um i've had better wines but i could chug her i could um i can sip her easily like She's easy on the palate. Um, I she's appreciate so her. I appreciate her. She's easy. She's an easy bitch, too. <laughs> I'm Megan. I'm Ashley. Thank, Thank you, you for, for watching, watching Poor Decisions. decisions. Got a mama, a couple of drinks. 
Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks. Gotta find myself a couple of drinks.